In this video, I'll show you how to get started with Raspberry Pico and Platform I.O. in four simple steps. First, install Visual Studio Code. Second, install Platform I.O. plugin. You can select here and uh, type Platform I.O. And this is the uh, plugin you need to install. After this installation, go to platforms, type Raspberry, click this, select, give install. Installation completed. Now click home. Now click project examples. Select Raspberry Arduino Blink. Import. This is our project. Here is a platform IO file. Let's remove this. Build. Go to the project folder. Go to build. And here you can see that uh, you you have to file. Okay, this file needs to be copied to the uh, disk Raspberry Pico disk. To get this disk, what you have to do is just uh, hold this button. and insert so this now you can see that LED is blinking now I will change the timing of that LED so let me make it a bit faster This device does not have any serial port, inbuilt serial port programmer. So before programming, we have to again press the button and uh, create the disk, copy the uh, firmware to the disk. Ready to go. Now you can see it is blinking a bit faster so in this i'll show you the second programming method this is the 10th pin from here uh, this is run pin or reset pin and this is the third pin from here this is uh, uh, ground pin so when you yeah you can see that it is uh, uh, resetting so if you touch this this will reset so just press this button boot selection and then you reset this now this will be in uh, boot mode you can see this uh, folder opens you note down the folder here mine is F drive so go to the platform I will Upload port is F colon. Then just uh, uh, you need to uh, install the driver for this. So select uh, 
Raspberry RP2 boot interface so you can install game install driver this will install the driver I have my driver is already installed so you can replace it press this button this is upload button press this you can see this will be uploading the yes upload is done so it will disconnect once upload is done so this is another one programming method